If you would understand, like Christ told Peter, after thou art converted, then strengthen your brother. You would understand that you can't go around trying to guide people when you yourself are blind. The Bible says blind leaders of the blind, they're going to fall in the ditch together. Oh, are you looking at this rock? Oh, did you really look at it from the angle that God wants you to look at? Now, now I got to throw this in here. You know, there was a little story once. Uh, we watched the movie a while back. It was called Jewelry. I don't know if anybody saw this, but this woman had caught her husband with another man. She got mad. She wasn't one of these women that would get that would turn around and break up all the dishes, bust out the windows, call you every ugly name she could think of. She was one of these women that would put some on you. So this is what took place. This one, I she she had caught the man. That's enough. She went and got the stuff, came back there where it was, and I mean. She, if, she didn't just panic and just go to just shoot him. Man, she walked in there and leveled straight up on him and cut it right between the eyes. <laughs> Took the poor fellow in the judgment. <laughs> so they get some. Oh, glory to God. Maybe y'all not looking at it right. Now, maybe y'all go, wait a minute. Nobody in here feel like that's what he deserved, did Oh, help me, 
when you let me move on. Now, 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 now sometimes, oh, depending on the situation, now you read, you, you would see it different. What if you were the one that cheated, would you need your brain blown out? Ooh, I know it's got kind of a oh, you know, uh, little gloominess in here. And you know what? I didn't even understand that as we were watching the movie, what had really gone on. And finally that guy, he started pimping. Wait a minute. Now, why are you like that? Ha, what about yo? Okay, yo, yo, your husband is dead now. Nah? So why don't you tell me about your and then and he said, evidently your husband did stuff to you to make you feel the way you feel. And she said, of trying to hold it in, you know. My husband, he was a good man. He worked. He took care of me. I had to do it. He did everything I want. I never had no reason to believe my husband would cheat. She tried to hold it in, and then finally she could hold. She had to let it out. She said. Don't tell them they have a few. And then this woman come walking up and I'm like, what you need to do? Yes, honey, because I got a right because I love him too and we got a relationship and I got a child out here. Guys, oh, I see why you feel like he needs to be busted between the eyes. Lord, help us here. <laughs> we move on. But, but they, they, they all were looking at the thing wrong. So you got to be careful how you look at it. Because you look at it wrong, you see it wrong. Amen. Oh, you see things that's not there. Now, as I go back to the, the, the blind man when Jesus had led him out of town. And, oh, glory to God. And when he led him out of town, the Bible says Jesus spit on his eyes. Oh, uh, this is going to have to deal with some of our church folk up in here a little bit. Jesus spit on his eyes and after he spit on his eyes, he put his hands on him and asked him and said, do you see all? And then what, do you see anything? And then the blind man said, open his eyes and say, I see men, but they look like walking trees. Oh, glory to God. He wasn't looking at them right. Now, when you see your sister or your brother, what do you see? I mean, even if they're in something, do you see a person that maybe needs help or do you see a devil? Oh, help me here. Do you see somebody that could be something when God get through with them? What I'm saying, this man had been touched by Jesus and yet didn't see right. So what are you saying here? Now just because maybe you go to the altar and you got a little touch, now that don't mean that you see it all. My God, there are people, and, 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 and if you took note, Jesus spit in his eye. Maybe you've been to the altar. People have stood over you. Maybe they patted your hands. Spit hit y'all in the face. That don't mean that you had it all. Sometimes there is a step further that we must go. Haven't you seen some folks sometimes they come there and they go on back and do the same stuff again? Because they needed something greater than what they got. Now you know 